Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about uh, Renat Fakhradinov versus Nicholas Dalby. Very interesting matchup, especially because how Renat looked against uh, Zaleski Dos Santos in his last one. The issue I have is, is Nicholas Dalby better than Zaleski Dos Santos? Good question. Um, I, I, think it's, I think it's a question that's a no. I believe they fought actually once before. He may have actually beaten him, but 40 years old. So strikes landed per minute, 4.05 for Renat, 4.03 for Dalby. That is what it is. Accuracy is 56 to 43. Absorbed 2.16 to 3.43. Defense 52 to 52. Pretty good. Here's where it's interesting. Takedown average for 15, 4.25 to 1.11. Accuracy is 46 to 30. Defense is 100 to 60. Submissions is 0.3 to 0.1. It's hard for me not to pick Renat. But, but, Nicholas Dalby with that weird, awkward style that he has could cause a lot of problems. I just don't think he can stay safe long enough not to get taken down. And I think if he gets taken down, even if he can get back up, a little bit of a problem for Dalby because Renat has that style to where he can catch you with big punches and then finish you. Dalby has to bank on that he can wear down Renat, that Renat didn't learn from his last one, wear him down, and then beat him up in the third round and try to finish him. I don't think he can do that. I don't think he does do that. Can he do that? Sure. I think Renat gets this job done. I think he comes back. He learns from that crazy majority decision draw from uh, Elizu Zaleski, who's underrated. Like I said, minus 290, so the betting betting guys are uh, green. But Dalby being a plus 235, I do think he's a live dog because at any point, Dalby can win this matchup. I'm not saying like he can finish him or like one shot him, but while the fight's going, Dalby has a chance to win. But I think Renat gets it done. I think his grappling is going to be on another level on this fight. Um, but he's six foot tall with a 74 inch reach. Dalby's 5'11 with a 74 and a half inch reach. 22 wins, two losses, one draw. Dalby's 23 wins, four losses, one draw. Like I said, great fight, great matchup. If Dalby can pull this one off, we're going to see him fighting in the top 15 here very soon. But. This is going to be a good fight. And as always, as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know you're picking. I'll see you at the next one. Peace.